All right, welcome back, everyone. Hello, everybody. This is uh, well, Eric, and this is Stain Tupperware, and and this is Eli, and this is Stain Tupperware. And this is Paper Mario. Woo! And this is Stain Tupperware. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, so we're still in the middle of the boring woods. I mean, the Bogley Woods. Uh, probably the slowest part of this game. Eric and I were just saying, too, another part of what makes this section just so rough is how... Oh, I remember. Yeah, you gotta, like, you gotta blow him. But, uh, the music for this area is also just... Huh. It's... You could fall asleep to it. Oops. Way to go, Joe. I'm really bad at the jumps in this. There we go. All that just to go down a pipe. Oh yeah, and these stupid spiders that the punies are afraid of. There's the spiders, there's the the X things. And then there's um there's like mosquito looking things. Oh, and I don't have uh I got to get better at remembering to uh Oh, it's going to happen a lot. Don't worry about it. That's a spider. Ick. They grossed me out. Max HP is 5, attack is 2, and defense is 0. Ew. What about their stats as ew? Besides its normal attacks, it might spit three web wads at you consecutive. Web wads. That's the word of the day, everybody. <laughs> web wad. That's what you call someone on the internet who's a dick. Get out of here, web wad. <laughs> you better have good timing if you want to guard against its attacks. Actually, I find this one's one of the easier ones to time the, the defense for. It also says here that the puties can't stand piters, so I'm not the only one. Just the, just the sight of these things makes punies flee in terror. I know how they feel. Pow! Come on, Eric, there's so much time leading up to it. Yeah, it's just I can't time things well, so... Um, Get him, Joe. There we go. Take that, Piter. Look, he's got a bullseye on his back. Yeah, he does. Nice. And... Now he's gone. Woo, a whole four star points or whatever. What is that thing supposed to be? On the plane pad. Can you blow it away with with, with flurry? Possibly. Where are my They probably fell down. Uh Try uh try blowing it though first. Yeah, I was right. Alright. Now I'm gonna go down and see if I can wrangle up some stupid... What are these things supposed to be, anyway? Uh, punies? Yeah, like a newt. Do you remember what? that show Ned's what? Newt? Ned's Newt. Ned's Newt. Ned's Newt. Ned's Newt. I can't Man, say I do. Something, what? something, something. Oh, Ooh. someone's gonna throw some power at you. Oh, you got full items. Gotta use some items, Joe. Hmm. Screw it. Stopwatch. Oh, yeah. So, uh, no, Ned's new. You don't remember that? There's always one of those shows that came on when you were supposed to be at school, so you only saw it when you were sick. 
<laughs> so, <laughs> so, like, just thinking of that show kind of makes me feel sick in a certain way. He was like a giant, like, blue newt, if I remember. Next newt. Yeah, no, can't say I remember it by name alone, anyways. There. Oh! Here, I'll put a bingo I'll put, counter. I'll put a picture up on the screen so everybody can see it too. Of Ned's Newt. Oh, bingo counter too? Yeah. Oh crap, bingo counter. Yeah, All bingo right. counter. Woo! Ah! This audience in this fight's really like throw crap at you happy today. <laughs> Get him! Squish that speeder! And there's the body slip. So, there's my question to all of you. Oh, I think you're getting double coins. Oh. Um, Real lucky then. <laughs> My question to all of you: What was that show that would only you you'd only ever see it when you were home sick from school? Does anybody have a, a specific show? Don't say Price is Right too. Everybody can say that one. Yeah, <laughs> that's the that's the most unoriginal one. What was that other? Um, it's like a TVO one. There was like that the bird with the propeller. Everybody's like the animation was all weird and cyber chase. Yeah, I think that one was another one of those like Just only ever on When I felt gross Yeah oh, I hate ow I hate rhythm game type things and I really hate trying to time the uh I can get that earthquake one like at the full like the max amount a lot not every time I'm not a I'm not a savant but often he used gunk shot wait a minute this isn't Pokemon there we go but if you haven't checked that series out, you should. We're more than halfway done. Yeah. Uh, All right. Is Where to there a next? point to the flight pad? Probably. There's probably something down here that you have to fly, like midway up, right? Yeah, probably. I almost guarantee that's what it is. There's like a thing that's that's at the midway height thing. They wouldn't put it there if they, there was no point to it. There's probably oh. another flight pad over there. And yeah. And you fly back to get that shine sprite. That's probably exactly what it is. Shiny. Woohoo! I'm making the airplane! I have a book on how to make airplanes, like paper airplanes. To which you may be thinking, who needs a book on how to make paper airplanes? Me. <laughs> no, there's actually like a whole bunch of different really cool designs in there. I had two books, but I used one to kill a really big spider, and I think I threw it out after that. <laughs> I just, it was. <laughs> I'd rather never have the knowledge of those paper planes again than than clean the guts of the spider off the front cover. <laughs> uh. Oh, there's one of those things that we're about to commit genocide to. Oh yeah. It's a jabby. Oh, we should probably be reading these. I used to get along with Jabby. He's of the Jabby tribe. Jabble. Jabble. I wonder if Jabble's even my enemy now. You, if I remember... Oh. If I remember right, you can actually find Jabble. And he joins up with the punies. What? Yeah. He's in a bar that's kind of a bitch to find. Oh, 
Everyone, it's the Jabbies! It's a 10 Jabby Squadron. Let's get them. Come on, Mario. Whoa, Nelly. What do you have to do? Just blow them into the wall? Or smack them? Or... Wow, we did it. We murdered every single one of them. See that one there twitching on the ground? He had a <laughs> wife and kids. He'll never see them again. Now let's go kill his wife and kids. So are they supposed to be mosquitoes or wasps? I think kind of like just a... They're just meant to, like, be that general... Flying nuisance. Like, it could... I think the whole point was to make it look like it could be a mosquito, or it could be a wasp, or it could be a... Woohoo, blue key. Um, you know, black fly or something. Those get really bad in the summer here. At times. Yeah. Oh, what was the password? Uh, bug... Moon... Hold on. Let me pull up our own YouTube channel. Because <laughs> I wrote it down as an episode title. And they'll never come back, and that's what's going to happen to us, and... Hey, by the way... What's that thing you've been holding on to so tightly? She's got food! Kill her! It's a mushroom. Oh, not to be, like, rude, but it looks all wrinkly and gross. Don't talk about my penis. Yeah, yeah, I know. I picked it so I could give it to my brother to eat. But then he got captured. Then I got captured and stuck in here. He didn't get captured. And after a few days, it dried out. Oh, really? Great story. Cool story, bro. That's basically what they just did to him. <laughs> Guys, you're captive. Can you not... Can you set aside the pettiness for a minute? Anyway, don't worry so much. All the complaining aside, I'm sure Punio will return. Oh, it's Sun, Moon, Bug, Star. Sun, don't Moon, forget. Bug, Star. Go watch that episode. And... Up this pipe. They've gone up the ventilation shaft. And do I have to refight everything? No. This is getting out of hand. Now there are 11 of them. Ouch. All right. Uh... Where are those droid <laughs> You just have, like, that entire movie memorized? I have all of the... Nah. I have one through six memorized. But I won't get into that for, like, a ninth time on the channel. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Damn it, Mario. I remember getting stuck for so long in this game. Like, in this part of the game. I think it was something stupid, too, like I left the orb in a weird spot, or... Look, another one. Woohoo! Now we Teach upgrade to everybody. Remember to explore more. So I wonder who we should upgrade... ...after... ...Goombella. Um... That's a good question. I know, uh... Um, Maybe the Yosher? Maybe, but also I know uh, Koops gets a thing where he basically drops a giant Koopa shell on you for extra defense. That could be really helpful in some of the more annoying Uh Vivian's fights. got one where you can just disappear for a turn. That's... That one's mandatory for some of the fights. Yeah. Come on, up the damn pipe. Tootie, I'm back. We brought the key. We're opening the cell right now. Uh, oh, I see why it dropped to ten. I was gonna say, you ran away. Is it the blue one? No, it's the green one. Big brother! Oh, oh that's, that's you. Yeah. Big brother! Little Petunie! 
Are you alright? You're not hurt, are you? Nope, I'm fine. Thank heavens! Hey, big brother. I have something for you. I meant to give this to you sooner, but... Mushrooms are your favorite, aren't they, big brother? But... Well, this one got kind of dried out. Keep it. Oh, nasty. Big oh, brother. Oh, that's nasty. It was icky, wasn't it? I'm sorry. Don't take any of this dialogue out of context. <laughs> uh, no. Uh, delicious. Uh, very uh, yummy. <laughs> Big brother, you okay? No! <laughs> just like starts like dry <laughs> heaving in the corner <laughs> give me a hug patootie i think i'm gonna die from that mushroom you gave me hey quit it punio come on don't get all mushy everyone's staring well it was just a really street sweet gesture that's all anyway back to the war we're fighting oh it was nothing now you've got 101 these aren't Dalmatians. The brochure said they'd be Dalmatians. I love how once you get this entire army, I feel like this. Down. I feel like this whole section is just for Nintendo to show off how many assets they could have on screen at once. Yeah, probably. That's the only reason this level exists. Hence, why it's so boring compared to all the other levels in this game. Because it was just shoehorned in by a Nintendo exec to show off how many assets the GameCube could do at once. Can y'all follow? <laughs> Come on now. This way. Hurry. Stupid punies. Down, down here. I don't know how you can remember where to go. I'm. I'm lost. Everything looks the same in this crappy ass level. Honestly, I'm not even sure myself how I know where everything is in this level. Oh, I forgot there's some that pop and you gotta send them again. Because they're morons. Get there over there! Ugh. One. A single freaking one. Guys, there's only a hundred now. Well, what happened <laughs> to that one? Nothing? Don't ask questions. I ripped his stupid ball off his head when he decided not to listen to me. And I guess he died from that. You should have told me his heart was in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I thought it was a silly hat. Mario. I'm gonna beat your ass. Go down the pipe. Screw you, Mario. Wahoo. If I lose another puny because I'm moving fast, I'm gonna be very upset. And you won't like him when he's very upset. It's not like the Hulk, though. It's more like the... She-Hulk? He'll be a lawyer. I haven't watched that. I keep meaning to watch a whole lot of the Marvel stuff, just there's so much of it now. Yeah, yeah, it, it can feel like a, like if you're not watching it at all, you're just doomed to not understand half of it. Yeah. That could be how it is with um, Star Wars sometimes though. Like, I have a coworker and she was, she, Likes to watch like all the like Mandalorian and all that, but she refuses to watch the Clone Wars, Bad Batch, Rebels, and all I'm saying to her is, you are missing a huge chunk of the story. I'm like, you don't even know who these characters are in the Mandalorian. I'm like, you don't know who Bo-Katan is. You don't know who Ahsoka is. They all have incredible relevance to the story, and she just ignores it because cartoon. Yeah. And I will say, the first two seasons of both Clone Wars and Rebels are they're childish. The animation isn't the greatest. The music for Clone Wars, the first two seasons, is also really 
it's not Star Wars. Like, the music in the first two seasons is, is like, a lot of, like, that... Like, you know, like, upbeat club music almost. And, and then, you know, I think they got their feedback and they realized what changes needed to be made and they made them. And, uh, like, by the end of the Clone Wars and, like, these new Bad Batch and stuff like that, the animation is phenomenal. You forget you're watching a cartoon. Um... And then, you know, of course, the music's a lot better. Hey, it's Jabble! Yeah, I found Jabble. Wow, I never knew Jabble existed. Is this optional? Um, yeah. Wow. Hey, I'm pretty sure that one puny with the hat and the glasses there, I'm pretty sure he's in the pit of 100 trials. Like, you run into him somewhere down there. Oh, neat. Oh, what a precious little thing. He hasn't done anything wrong. Mario, we simply must go easy on the poor deer. No, let's get him! <laughs> Tear his wings off one by one. Oh, what ails you, my little pudding pie? He seems so lonely, doesn't he, Mario? Why, he looks like I do when I step into the spotlight and then forget my very first line. Oh, hold up now. You know what? I believe he might wish to join us. Yeah. I had heard the rumors from a damn flurry to them jabbies. Yeah, the word is out. Mario can win over the hearts of anyone. I tell ya, as a people person and a salesman, I must say I'm more than a little jealous. Anyway, you wanna buy this rock? Oh? What about this gift someone left here? These jabbies are so annoying to micromanage. What's uh, that one gonna say? Look, the hat one. Shop is hard to spot, so I've been in here hiding from those goons the whole time. Coward! Meanwhile, you send children off to battle. Those fiends have been searching high and low for something inside this tree. What could they be looking for? You have any idea? And I'm low on health, so I am healing. What's that sign say? It says... Oh, right. I forgot there's like a point system. Yeah. You know what's weird? Can Ooh, I talk about something? <laughs> Weed has been legalized in Canada for a few years now. And it's still a little hard to get used to. I can sign up for like points programs at my local weed store and like become a member and like it's just weird. It's so strange to me. Yeah. Meanwhile, you... I still hide it when I still see people. <laughs> I'm still so used to the stigma that came with it. There oh. we go. Come on. Uh, let's just do this. I looked up how much, like, the government had made off of, off of it, too. Between legalization and 2021. When was it legalized again? Uh, I think it was 2019. Yeah, I think so. But, again, it was a really slow start, too. It wasn't just, like, one day it was all legal. It, it, was, it was a really slow kind of process. It, you couldn't get edibles for about a year and a half after it was legalized. Like, it took a long time to get that approved and, and through. And, but, between legalization and 2021, the government had made something like $40 billion off of the weed industry. Like, that's insane money. Yeah. And that's just the money they're making, because they're, they're still, like, not legal dealers around. And, and, you know, people who are trying to make their own buck on it and not giving the government a piece of the pie. So that's just what's recorded. There's more weed shops in Canada than there are coffee shops now. They're on every corner. Yeah, I think that's kind of funny, it's to be harder, honest. It's harder to find a gas station than it is to find a fucking weed store in Canada. <laughs> oh. 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 
Oh, I'm not even taking any chances. Eat hammer. Well, that's annoying. Yeah. But at least I got all this extra stuff. You know. Can't complain about more coins. Half of them just stay up here. How do I get that? Um. Oh! Is there a secret block under it that Coops can hit? I think there might be. Aha! Badge time! Ooh, damage dodge P. Nice. Too bad you can't dodge with Goombella. <laughs> you get the timing with Mario most of the time, but not Goombella, so her health is like half of what yours is now. Hey, uh... There we go. It's a hundred jabby squadron! Look how many assets the GameCube can load all at once. Are you impressed? Some with, Nintendo exec was. With almost no slowdown. You're gonna have a seizure looking at their wings. Right? Charge! Yeah. You're fired! Yeah. I'm not sure that there's much I... There we go. <laughs> oh, but, they're KO'd. They'll be fine. I think. They won't be fine. Ah. <laughs> uh. Do they have to make the controller, like, pulsate? <laughs> Smack! Aha! I struck first! Take that, you stupid piranha plant. Yeah, double stylish. La 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 la. Hmm. A quake hammer. Can she do anything? Um, just use the Gale Force. Screw it. You got a lot of FP items sitting around that you need to use up anyway. What? It's because he's rooted. Alright, then I'm just gonna finish this with a regular hammer. Yeah, I got a single stylish too. Waste my FP, will you? So I'm assuming you're gonna get a butt bounce soon. Yeah, probably. But first... There's a question for everybody. Butt bounce or ground pound? What do you prefer to call it? I'm more of a butt bounce man. Like to watch that booty jiggle. I mean, <laughs> let's check the bushes. How'd you just drop to seventy nine? That was weird. It's because they got all confused by the bushes. Uh oh. The plant, the piranha <laughs> plant just eats like 10 punies in one big gulp and now you're stuck forever in the tree. That would suck. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, uh oh. Someone's throwing something at you. Bastards. Let's, uh, do something kind of funny here. Wahoo. It's a me, a Mario. 
There we go. <laughs> yeah, that worked. I mean, I wasted the power shake thing, but... Oh, whatever. We gotta use up the items anyway. Yeah, that's kind of my thought. Ooh, coin. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of jabby. So shouldn't you actually have 102? Because Probably. somewhere in there, there's a jabby. Yeah. Where is he, anyway? I don't see him at all. Uh... Can you spot the jabby? I don't see him. in there somewhere considering the hatred these these punies have for the jabbies I'm sure one of them just slid his throat when no one was looking he died somewhere hmm. he's on the ground twitching in some back room well this is annoying I don't know how to uh... you can't ground pound yet no you gotta drop down from above and land on that which requires a ground pound Hmm. All right, maybe that there's a red door that I missed a back here. So I was like looking at it, doing that. I don't think that's the right way. Well, you know what? We can find the right way next time on Stained Tupperware. Catch y'all later. See you later, everybody.